Hey guys, it's Dan from DisneyInfinityCodes.com, and I'm here to take a quick peek at the new villain from Alice Through the Looking Glass. It is Time, the one and only. A new character, one of three from the new Alice franchise, and uh, he's a pretty cool character and a uh, pretty awesome design, and we've already seen him kind of uh, play inside the game uh, because of a, a, a error with a, a patch a few weeks ago, but now we get the, uh, the figure and we can play with them inside the game. Now he hit the shelves a little early in my area. I'm not sure what the deal is, uh, but I went, took them and bought them and uh, they let me walk away with them. So uh, I've got time and I thought I would open them up and we could take a peek. So um, take a peek, of course, you're gonna require an update. You need to patch the game. I believe time comes in with the Marvel Battlegrounds patch. So if you've already patched with Marvel Battlegrounds, you should have him. It's a pretty hefty character. He got a lot of weight to him. Uh, 3.0, of course. And um, if we turn it around. We can take a peek at the back here. We can see time inside the toy box. And then it says here time from the movie Alice through the looking glass. Slows and stops time using his chronosphere. So uh, that's pretty cool. And if we take a peek here at the bottom, you can see there is Alice and the Mad Hatter there as well. Cool. So let's uh, let's pop open time and take a peek at his figure. What's interesting is that there is no web code card inside the time box because they have done away with web codes. Well, they've kind of done away with infinity, but more on that later. <laughs> and uh, he's a pretty hefty uh, figure, which is kind of cool. He's got a lot of weight and uh, sturdiness to him. The cool thing I've just I first noticed here is the base. The character is actually standing on a tea saucer. And uh, all three of the characters, Alice, Mad Hatter, and Time, all are standing on a tea saucer with their own unique colored ring. So I think that's pretty cool. Get a nice little close-up here of the uh, of the tea saucer thing. That's cool. And then um, he's got a really cool t uh, you know pose here. His his robes are nice and long and flowing. In fact, they're actually hanging off the back of the character in the back, which is kind of interesting. Got the big uh, mustache. And you can see his uh, little pendulum um, necklace piece there. And if we turn him around, we can see a lot of beautiful detail work. Let me bring a light over here just so we can you see a lot of beautiful detail work running up the uh, the robe here, as well as there's some really cool clockwork kind of uh, mechs on the back of his head. The really gorgeous sculpt on uh, on time, really really beautiful, cool looking figure. So there you go, folks. There is time. Unfortunately, one of the last few unboxings we will have forever for Disney Infinity, but still a really beautiful figure super excited to uh, pop them down on the system and and play with them inside the game so there you go folks as always thanks so much for watching and visit us at disneyinfinitycodes.com